163 in for Shane Lowry. Oh, brilliant. This is 18, this is for Eagle. This is 68. Oh, what a pop from the run. Well, it's a good shot, so you'd imagine it would be. Well, it certainly was. Is it a one? It's not far away. It's not far away. It's just going to go left. Like it was this morning, virtually no wind to speak of. Great scoring conditions. Oh, what a lovely way to save your car, Billy Hartshaw. Tony Fino, the tall man from Utah. Well, that's a bit better from Fino. Birdie to first, birdie to third. Eagle at four. Will it moves to eight under and into the lead? Doesn't seem like the best strike here for John Rahm, but ah, oh, deceptive. <laughs> He's not happy with it, but we are. He'll like the result. He knew he'd left it short, Alison. <laughs> He's not for playing par golf this morning, is he? Two bogeys followed by three birdies. Fortunately, Horshaw visited the water at the eighth. So back to the drop zone, fourth shot. for Billy Horschel. He was talking with huge enthusiasm at the start of the week about how delighted he was to be here. It was always one of his favourite tournaments to watch on TV as a youngster. First look at 14. I8 BMW for hole in one today. This is Shubhshanka Sharma. Bit today, 20 on five right. Oh, that's a gorgeous shot. That's a nice, accessible pin there. Oh, wait a minute. Wait a minute. <laughs> I will give you a wee drive in the car for that one. But he's the boss, so I better say nothing. So difficult from here. You are kidding me. Oh. That is unbelievable. You look at the yardage book and you put a big red X oh. over on that right-hand side to that pin, but it's worked for Poseidon now. That will do nicely. We end up with the day now, Paul Casey. About 12 feet of green to work with, which is all going away from. If he's going to get anywhere near the hole, he's going to bounce it probably twice in the rough before it reaches the fringe. Very dangerous shot here. <laughs> a little giggle, maybe rightly slow, so, but oh, what a finish. 
for Tony Finau. He's had a few laughs at this ending hole on the golf course. It's in the six under part. Victor Hovland, he was 22 on Wednesday. Record-breaking amateur career, won the low amateur prize in both the Masters and the US Open. In fact, in the US Open, he was 12th as an amateur because he can play golf like this. He is an absolute superstar in the making. You have to consider us to be masochists. Doug Wiesberger, 12, oh yes. Oh, double yes. Oh, yeah, triple yes. <laughs> oh, you beauty. <laughs> Fantastic for an eagle. Ryder Cup captain, Boric Harrington. Plus two, you see his line 79th. Right now, level par is 51st, and plus one is 62nd. So that's a fabulous shot there. Boric almost a car. Well, yeah, no approximate what clubbed it after his playing partner's a big, high, towering one. Rafa can't hit it quite as high. And the pin just cut a little ridge in the green. Skidded out, did he? Oh, right behind it. Rory unlikely to hit that shot. He throws everything up in the air and he's going to be at the mercy of the wind, which at the moment seems to have died. Hopefully that will be a birdie for Rory. He needs three of them in the next five holes. Fantastic opening birdie, but thank goodness the hole got in the way because that wasn't far off the front fringe of it missed. Aaron Rye at the back of the par three fifth, which is not a bad but In fact, it's an extremely good place to be. Who needs the green? Back to back birdies, two. about five and a half yards from the pin. Yeah. Very nice, Patrick Reed. <laughs> now the third, 87 yards left for Rose. Not the best angle either. <laughs> but he's played it beautifully. And we'll have a fantastic opportunity to walk away with par and play the opening three, one under the card. Great shot. We'll go to Molinari. Oh, birdies, one par. Oh, par's one birdie, I should say, sorry. I love a lovely iron shot from Francesco Molinari. He really is exquisite. Is any club in his hand. This looks interesting. Just got more interesting. Well, he, he doesn't does. mind holding out, does he? No, he just slam dunk yesterday, Dougie, for his par on eight. That was extraordinary, and it? Very daintily addressed, his left foot sticking out there. Long range for Sharma, for birdie. Don't tell him that. Yeah. 
very nice. Three birdies in the last four holes. Victor Hovland, bit of trouble. The pin's on the back, 28 on, 6 from the left. Oh, wow. To pick that, that is just magnificent. He picks that on the upslope to kill it, coming out of the rough. A lot of topspin shot of the day so far for Victor Hovland. Including a win in the Rolex Series event. Great angle here for Rose from 122, left side of the fairway, right hole location. And he takes advantage of it. That is as sweet as could be. Lovely uphill putt. What an opportunity for Bird. Ross Fisher at 18. He knows quite well as well as anyone. A member of the youth program here. Got a lot of help from the club as a young golfer. And it's paid off. Fisher, how much will he enjoy that one? What a way to finish, an albatross too. Oh, that's one of the great Wentworth moments. By my calculations, he's eight under on the back nine. Thanks to that. And the five other birdies he had. Wow. And of course, he gets to win a BMW i8 Roadster for the first, maybe the only, Albatross at 18. Well done, Roscoe. That is absolutely brilliant. <laughs> Just double checking it is in there. Oh, it is. Yeah, middle of the 11th fairway. The Zayden Hood, 12 under par. Behind it, let's really try and get you know, get after it. Oh, that's another delicious shot from the young South African. He's only two behind, and he's going along the level of the rough, so quiet, please. There's not a lot going for this shot, let me tell you. Well, I don't believe that. He's just played the shot of the day. No question about that. Mark that down as one of the greatest shots ever played at Wentworth. <laughs> and he knows it. Third shot at the par five for Billy Horschel. Very makeable here. Very makeable. He hurt us. That's an eagle. What a great start to the day. This one is you had seen Allison several times today already. Has a big swing from the left. It's one you just want to take the high line and just dye it in that front left portion of the hole. You don't want that four footer coming back. Everyone's going to be a bit nervous. Strokes gained, numbers have improved. 16 under for Danny Willett. First blow struck. Leif Johnston. Great angle for the back right pin. Superb and a really good shot from playing partner. That was Eden Hood. Let's get to 14 under. We'd just be three behind on six. It's a big ask. A long putt. That's the speed it's going to get there. Is it going to tie? Oh, it's in. Oh, Christian, the Eden Hood. 
fantastic. So you can put two hands up there. The powers of deduction, Sam. Sharp cookie me, watch yourself. Partial. Oh, sweet chuck. Real bail from just off the green. Turn now, is it? Well, maybe it is. Oh, yes, Rafa Cabrera Bale. A wee surprise dive left at the end. And a happy Spaniard. Fourth birdie today, and he gets the 14 under. Look when you get excited, Sam. You see words like wee surprise. Mm. Good pace. Oh, goodness. Oh, my goodness. Can you believe it? Escape from Alcatraz. That is an incredible bogey from Danny Willett. What a putt. Turning points, you better believe it. Patrick Reed playing with Richie Ramsey. side of the fairway, nice place to be on 16 for their back right flag. It's a beaut. Had a look, changed its mind. Second at 16. Christian is even taught from South Africa. This has a little change of direction at the start of his downswing. He certainly changed it very nicely there. Fantastic shot to 16. Get it up and turn it right to left around the trees. 146 playing like 152. This looks magnificent. It really was. What a shot of the week, I'd have to say, in this position right now from Danny Willett. That was absolutely magnificent. So many things could have gone wrong there in that bunker. But they didn't. To watch another European Tour video, click here. And to subscribe, click here.